Hi everybody and a welcome to our channel. <laughs> so today I have a Ross haul. Yes, y'all. I did it. I did it. I walked up in Ross. I went in Ross. I, my budget was like a hundred, was under a hundred dollars, which was eighty dollars that I spent. So I was really excited about it. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. But before we start, I want to let you guys know, have a good day despite anything that comes your way, okay? Have a great day, okay? And also, drink lots of water. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, so first we're gonna start a cleaning product. I do, I did buy two of each, so one times two, you know, I have two of those. Um, and this I bought for my uh, cleaning surfaces. I'm gonna put it over here so you guys see. For my cleaning surfaces, most per most mostly, um, and my towel because I have towel in my my um, my kitchen and in my bathroom and on, um, for my marble on my cat cabinet, which I DIY, you guys. Um, but I want to get a good shine on those things, and so I bought this Clean Lux Multi Surface Citrus Cleaning Powerful Cleaning for Hard Surface. And this was like $5.99 at Ross, but I got it for $2.99. So I was really excited to get this plus another one. And you are not eating this. It's too early in the morning. Bye. Thank you. See you later. What? Uh, what? Um, and then I found some of the Honest Co. Um, Honest Dish Soap Lavender. It smells so good. And it's powerful clean. Um, powerful cuts grease. So this smells really good. I smelled it earlier and it smells so good. It smells good. Um, but yeah, it smells really good. And if you're looking to transition your, chemi your chemical household into like a natural household, I would definitely suggest you go to Ross if you're a mom or dad. Uh, definitely go to Ross Are and find inside? these products on the Lolo. You don't have to go to like the regular What's store and spend inside? a lot of money because I only spent $2.99 on this. Um, and I know like wow. Targets may have it for like two dollars and some change, or I don't know. But sometimes Targets have their their honest is really expensive, like maybe three or four dollars. But I bought it at Ross for a whopping two ninety nine. And the girl at the register was really nice. That's so why I tell you guys be nice with the cashiers because she said she had like a ten percent off employees discount. She's like you guys are so cute, and she's talking about her her nephew. Um, and, um, and I was telling her about Ashton and how he has like chores and stuff. And she said her nephew asked, like, if his mom asked him to do a chore, he asked her to pay him. And I'm like, oh no, that's not happening. Um, so yeah, but yeah, Asia J gets an allowance and it might be like two or three dollars because he's six. So, um, he definitely puts it in his piggy bank. And of course, you know, he's a little boy, so he is sick. Dingy, so don't ask him for no change, okay? Don't ask him for no coins because he's he would definitely if you ask him for some coins, he'll give you some coins, like he'll give literally give you some change. If you ask him for a dollar, he's gonna give you 10 cents, okay? That's just how he do that's just how he roll, okay? So, okay, so the next thing I have is food wise or maybe syrup and we'll, we'll see. So, I found some green tea matcha boost. Perfect for beverage blending and toppings. Unsweet and easy to mix. Matcha powder. I didn't know you could put matcha powder in like smoothies and cupcakes and stuff like that. So I'm really excited to be like baking up some stuff and showing you guys, you know, my big mess because it probably would turn into a mess. But um, I'm going to probably look up some recipes to make like matcha muffins or something like that. I don't know. It's unsweetened, so it's really good for my low carb, and I can't wait to try this. I'm not sure if my son or kids can have it, but um, I just can't wait to try it. Okay, so the other thing that I found there was sugar-free classic hazelnut flavoring syrup. And this has Splenda in it. So, yeah. <clears throat> I found this brand. If you guys ever tried this brand, let me know in the comments below. Let me know how you liked it. And then I found the sugar-free vanilla one as well. <clears throat> I've never tried these, so I don't know what to look forward to. Other than they're sugar-free and that's really good. 
Also, so next thing is just like lunch stuff that I have for uh, work. And <clears throat> I have this blender, um, this blender jar thing here, which you can put like fruit at the bottom or you can put your mint in the center of it. Or you can actually take this out and use it for your protein powder. Um, but yeah, you can put your multivitamins in there or meds. Or you can just take this by itself. So I really like the options of how you can take your um, your protein blender with you. You don't really have to take the whole thing. You can just break it in half and do what you got to do. But I like this right here. So I got this one um, <clears throat> for more for my protein because I'm going to start taking protein and stuff like that. And then I'm going to start taking my lunch. Yes, yeah, she's going to start taking her lunch because... Buying lunch is very expensive when you at work, so I was just like, mm -mm. so I'm gonna start not prepping because I can't. I don't. I don't. I don't like prepping food because I don't like how it sits in the refrigerator and it's just there or whatever. If you love prepping food, you know, to each his own, you know. Um, and I've tried prepping. Don't get me wrong. Don't don't get me wrong. But I only write like maybe four four days, four or five days out the week at my job and. Sometimes I don't even like think about getting food out the refrigerator. Like I haven't even like made my mind think, hey, you need to go and get that f that lunch out the refrigerator for your lunch today. So um, I feel like just having one of these will get me motivated to start prepping the day before and then taking it to lunch or whatever, or taking it for, to work for lunch. Um, so yeah, I bought this um, head homemade lunch time is the best time um food storage and it has it on the on the sides like lunch time is the best time <laughs> it's really cute so i found one of these just one and i was just like i wanted to find another one like a, this the large one medium and small one but they didn't have it all they had was these so maybe it's kind of popular i don't know um and then i got these two journals here one says notes and the other one says God has made everything beautiful in its time. Um, so I got that, two of those. And I already start using my note one to jot down like what I need to get from the store, the grocery store. So yeah, I just can't wait to start using it like completely, completely. So I think this is going to be more for my meals and stuff like that. And then this was just going to be like, you know, how was my day stuff like that so yeah i'm just gonna yeah um that is the end of our ross haul you guys um good thing about ross is that 100 percent of your pro the 100 percent of your purchase is um put towards girls and boys clubs so i would definitely go there spend some money it don't have to be like over 100 bucks it can be like maybe five or ten dollars but whatever you spend it goes towards the girls and boys clubs um in your city if you have one of those so i would definitely go ahead and go to ross and make a purchase today so that we can help the kids out and help the the people out at the girls and Cl boys club to supply them with like supplies that they need to teach uh the kids when they get out of school or bus like van fan, uh van gas to when they go to the school and pick them up and take them back to girls and boys club so yeah anyways you guys that's the end of our haul we'll see you next vlog have a wonderful day bye